Major League Baseball has suspended Rocky shortstop Jose Reyes without pay through May 31st. This comes after Reyes violated the league's domestic violence policy for an alleged confrontation with his wife in October. The suspension is retroactive to February 23rd when Reyes was first put on paid leave by the league. As part of the discipline, Reyes will donate $100,000 toward the prevention and treatment of domestic violence. All told, Reyes' suspension will cost more than $6 million in salary. Here's a statement from Jose Reyes. I want to apologize for everything that has happened. I am sorry to the Rockies organization, my teammates, all the fans, and most of all, my family. I am happy to put this all in the past and get back to doing what I love most, playing baseball. My wife, Catherine, has remained by my side throughout everything, and for that, I will be forever grateful. Now, for more on Jose Reyes, Marley Rivera joins us now on SportsCenter. Uh, Marley, how are the Rockies reacting to the suspension of Jose Reyes? Well, the Rockies had a meeting. They had a team meeting and addressed it with all the players before they opened the clubhouse today at 2.55 Mountain Time. And one of the things, the main message was that the team is here to play baseball, that after this meeting they feel good about themselves, that Jose, of course, is a part of the organization and he'll be welcomed back as a teammate, but that it's basically a tough situation for the front office and the players don't have you know, much to do with it. They don't have, they don't have, they don't make the decision. So they're saying some other, for example, Carlos Gonzalez said he's very proud to be a friend of Jose Reyes and he made some mistakes, but he is going to pay for them. And that he's a player that has a very good track record and put up some really good numbers with the Mets. So he's looking forward to welcoming him back to the team. Now, his teammate, Trevor Story, he's filling in for Reyes at shortstop. He's among yes. the league leaders with 11 home runs and 27 RBI this season. What does that now mean for Jose Reyes and his future in Colorado? The interesting thing is that they, we asked Trevor Story precisely that question, and he said it's not something that is going to affect him. He said, I'm not thinking about the future of what's going to happen when Jose comes back. That's basically he's. He used this old baseball cliche of taking it day by day and seeing how things work out. But GM Jeff Breidich said that it's been a long process. This is the end of it. And now we're moving on onto phase two. So they have to see what's going to happen in, with this type of suspension, which obviously they didn't have to deal with before, and then move forward. Right now, under the, under the domestic violence policy, Jose Reyes is allowed to train with the team and extend his spring training in Arizona. But... The Rockies say we haven't been part of this process. We haven't been privy to the details or the investigatory process. So now that they understand the penalty, now they can move on to phase two. So they do not know what comes next, even though now under the rules, we know he is allowed to report to Arizona. Well, time will only tell. The Rockies was already Jose Reyes' fourth team in the last six seasons. That's Marley Rivera with the latest on the suspension of Jose Reyes.